Hello YouTube, this is your boy Ricky British. I've been working on my bike for the last couple of days and um So that's the first hose being removed. So I'm gonna replace it with this one. So first of all I need to get use the old clamps because I don't have any new clamps but these clamps should fit. Yeah, this one fit. So it's gonna slide. So that's the first, this one, that's the first was.
Oi, o que é isso aí? O seu vaso falou no negócio. Já. Vaso. Não, isso é vaso e não chega de LG drauf. E eu vou ir até a barra para a mamãe. Hum? E eu vou ir até a barra para a mamãe. Why? Because I'm using it. Hum. Com o que eu posso.
So now the three hoses are connected. So I'm gonna put them back together now, try and get them back together. So I need to first I need to get the hose through here. One gonna come around this side. So we need to push it. I need to come around here. So that's the first one. The next one need to come underneath. My bike yeah. is in bits. Bits and bits and bits. So um I want to install some silicone hose which I bought from a site of eBay so I get eight silicone hose in the pack and um, I want to install this temperature gauge it's just a simple te water temperature gauge anyway you know so I'm gonna install it and um, I have a brand new I have a brand new brand new radiator cap which I'll be installing as well because um I I am having some heating problem with my bike as well, so that's one of the reasons why. So the first, so I'm gonna start with the installation. So first of all, I need I need to empty the coolant from the bike. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with the, emptying the coolant. So I'll be using a 10 millimeter um, spanner to open the coolant, the reservoir, to let the coolant out. So I'm going to use this bottle to catch the coolant. So as I'm, as I'm opening, as I'm opening it, opening the, this bolt at the bottom, the coolant cap is closed. So there's no coolant coming out. So now I'm gonna open the radiator cap to see. You're gonna see how the coolant start to come out fast. Because um the hose, the new hoses, they are a bit thicker than the normal hose. So I had to get some new clips. I bought these clips off eBay, so I'm gonna use some 13 or 14 millimeter clip to hold the new to hold the new hose in place. So now that all the coolant is drained from the bike, I'm gonna go ahead and really and remove the hoses. That's one hose being installed. So there's one hose coming from here inside here, which I need to take off from underneath the tank. So I'm gonna raise the tank. Mm -hmm.
This side is being installed, so now I need to go and do the next side, which is this. I still have one hose left over, so I reckon there should be one long hose that go from the front to the bike somewhere to the back. But I don't know where to take this to put it on. So I have one hose, which is this long one. I reckon there's somewhere underneath here, but I'm not going to touch it.
so I've connected the other side so I just have one more hose which I'll be connected there should be a next hose but to tell the truth I don't I, I don't know how to take it out so I'm just gonna leave it so I'm just gonna take the last this is the last one I'm gonna take off I'm gonna put my rag to catch the cool up. So this is the last hose. So I'm putting on this one. So I'll be using the same clamps if they fit. Well, I don't have any more clamps anyway. And I don't intend to go and buy any more. Cheap steel. Actually, I might get some new clamps tomorrow. Because these clamps, they're cutting inside. So I'm just going to put this on for now, tomorrow I might go get some new clumps. So basically that's all my second hose being installed. So tomorrow I'm going to go ahead and finish installation. Which I'll be connecting the, the, um, the, each, the temperature gauge. So thank you guys for watching. If you like, share, subscribe and comment. Thank you. Bye. Well I want to thank you guys for watching. You know. um, I've, do, I've finished the install. And um, thank you guys for watching. And um, if you guys have any question, please don't free to ask and I'll answer them if I can. I'd appreciate it if you guys could like, share, subscribe. I, I basically need a thousand um, users, thousand subscribes. And as soon as I get a thousand subscribes, I'll be posting a question. And anyone answer the question right, I'll be, um, they'll be winning a cinema ticket for two. So doesn't matter which country you are, pay for the ticket by PayPal or whatever, the cinema ticket for you. So I'm still searching for a thousand subscribers so I can start at least to get paid and um, I can make more videos, can do more um, mods and stuff like that. So thank you guys for watching. I'm Ricky British.